new episode of Monster and Programming. In today's episode, I'll be showing you how you can create bottom sheets or how you can use bottom sheets inside of your app. So an example of that is if I click on this button, you can see that we get a bottom sheet here. The user can drag it halfway through or all the way to the top. I'll show you how you can customize how you allow your user to use it, whether it shows at the bottom, halfway, all the way at the top. I'll play around with it, show you how you can use it with all its settings. Without further ado, let's get started. Welcome back guys, now as you can see the first thing I have on the right side here is actually my iPhone So whenever we run the app here, it's gonna go ahead and run on my actual device Inside of here I've got my view which was the red view which appeared at the bottom I just created it as a third, uh, like a sec, a completely separate view just so that you can see that you can actually share or, or Im embed an actual view inside of the sheet And lastly we have our view here or the content view that we're going to be editing so the first thing I'm going to be doing is I'm actually going to go ahead and I'm going to come over here and I'm going to create a variable and it will just say show sheet and it will have the value of false and every time this changes from false to true that bottom sheet will appear. So let's go ahead and continue with that. Now I'm going to remove that text from here and instead I will be creating a button inside of that button we will simply say show sheet just how we have it here on the right side I'm gonna go over here I'll open and close the zigzaggy bracket to put some actions inside and then I'll say show sheet dot toggle and this allows us to toggle this from false to true or from true to false so after that we can go over here and actually create the sheet so I'm simply just going to write sheet is presented and here I'm going to say show sheet just like this we can go over here and open and close a zigzaggy bracket and inside of here just for now we're gonna start by putting text so we're just gonna show text in that sheet and we're just going to say something like this is the bottom sheet cool now right now if we actually go ahead and run this and I click on show sheet you can see that it gets presented in full view so the cust the user doesn't actually have any customization on where they how far they want this to be so it goes and fills the entire page we're gonna change that so what I'll do is I'll go over here or actually right underneath the text and I'll say dot presentation detent I'll open and close a bracket inside of here I'll put two boxes and then I'll say dot medium now if I go ahead and run this and click show sheet you can see that the sheet only goes halfway and this is something that you can want but it doesn't go all the way at the top even if I try drag it with my phone or with my hand now what if I want it to be both so let's say we want it to be to fill the entire screen at the same time as well well now if I go ahead and run this And I click on show sheet now it launches off with the first option that we have but at the same time it gives the user this drag point where they can actually drag it all the way to the top or in the middle as well now finally what if you want it to be at a specific position so what if you want this to, to go all the way here or all the way here but not all the way to the top or not at 50% well all we need to do is we need to come over here and we can simply put another comma dot fraction and inside of here you can really just put any percentage that you want for example I'm going to be putting 0 0.20 and if I go ahead and run this one 
it starts off with the smallest so you can see that it starts off at 20% I can drag it so that it's at 50% or we can put it all the way to the top and you can keep adding as many as you want so we can come over here and we can add another fraction and we can put something like 75 and if we run this show sheet you can see that it's over here at 50 at 75 and finally all the way to the top you can keep adding as much as you want the last thing I want to show you is that you can actually share an entire view inside of the share sheet uh, sorry inside of the sh bottom sheet or the sheet so anything that you put here is the content that will be presented and it doesn't have to be text or a button it can actually be an entire view that, cre that you created anywhere else so I've already created this another view and I'll just add it like this and I'm going to run this and now if I click and show sheet you can see it's the view it's the red one and it follows the exact same rules that we have set up thanks so much for watching if you have enjoyed this episode or learned something please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel see you in the next episode